If you are interested in GTA modded accounts account, boosting message, me on Facebook or Instagram, I have many GTA services. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and I'm glad to have you guys here today and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys a brand new solo car to service car merch that you guys can do in GTA 5 online and if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe I do post the latest GTA 5 online glitches right here on this channel. So let's not waste time and go straight into the video. So step number one guys you're going to require to have a service car and you want to make sure that the service car is active guys otherwise you will not be able to do this and you're also going to require to have the donor vehicle you're also going to require to have a bunker so step number one you want to make your way towards the bunker so we're going to use the same steps that we did in the first uh, car to service car merge so uh, this is a workaround and you guys can now do this completely solo so once you guys are inside the bunker your next step will be getting out of the bunker so uh, this is the reason that we require to have a bunker and you also want to make sure that you have all the jobs showing on the map so as you, as you guys can see i have all the jobs shown on the map and that's how we're going to job teleport ourselves towards the auto shop uh, you can also use a buzzard so you don't have to actually uh, teleport yourself towards the auto shop uh, but just get yourself there by any means and you now want to get into the donor vehicle and you want to hit right on the t before you hit right on the t-pad you want to call up johan so uh, you're also going to require to have a nightclub and uh, you, the reason we're going to call him up this is, is so that we can request the nightclub Ooh, goods totally. as soon as you are. request them you want to hit right on the t-pad it will then send you towards the auto shop or the workshop so once you guys are on the workshop you want to stay on the workshop and you will then be kicked off the workshop and in the end you will then be uh, back in the car or in the car slot and you then want to make your way towards the service car so once you guys are at the service car you want to hit right on the d-pad and once you guys hit right on the d-pad all the components from the donor vehicle will be transferred over towards the service car so it's easy as that however you are gonna require to wait for a good 20 minutes before you can actually save this vehicle or actually purchase it um, what you can do is you can ask a friend to come into the workshop and purchase this vehicle and then later on give it to you as a given cost to friends um, but anyways that's how it goes and I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did in any way drop the like button and that's all for me I hope to see you guys in the next one and I'm out. Peace.